Hello, it is Saturday, October 24th, 2015. I am back from the Wise Markets and the Giant Food. We'll call it Giant Food. I believe that is what they like to be referred to. All right, from the Wise Markets, I did do the, there's a Progresso deal going on right now. These Progressos are 97 cents a piece, I think. Hold on, let me get my matchups here so I got all my info for you. Yes, they're 97 cents a piece. They're limit of six. I did use a dollar off four coupon, which there is a Progresso printable. I think it's on coupons.com. Plus, we do have some from inserts from September 13th, Smart Source. There's supposed to be a Saving Star rebate as well, but I logged into my Saving Star account. I haven't been in there in probably months, if not a year. It says my account's been closed. I'm like, well, boo to you. I probably still had money in there, too. Thanks a lot. So I bought four of these. I took so that takes a quarter off of them, which is not bad. I got four creamy roasted chicken with herb dumplings. Does that not sound delicious? And we can pair it with some Alexia potatoes. Oh no. I got sweet potatoes and potato puffs. I love Alexia potatoes. There's nothing to not love about Alexia potatoes. The deal is Alexia potatoes this week are $1.97. It is a limit of eight. I did use the dollar off two Alexia frozen sides from the October 4th smart source number two, which is going to take 50 cents off, which makes it $1.47 a bag. I did buy four bags and I used two coupons. And, well... I should have took this back, but I, they looked good, too. I got McCain sweet potato crinkle cut fries by accident because they were mixed in with the Alexia. And I was in a hurry, and I picked this up. And then the coupon beeped, and I'm like, you know what? I could have took it back, and they could have avoided it from the register. But I was like, you know what? No, I'm going to buy it. Like, I don't like to be a pain here. And I'll definitely eat those, and they were on sale as well. So, can't. The, these were, I think those were $3 a bag, so. It's like, yeah, yeah, it's fine with me. I'm not, I, I'm not hard, I'm not too picky. If you haven't figured that out by now. So, for a total of $11.76, I got four cans of Progresso and five bags of potatoes. So, not bad. Save 59%, $17.45. All right, and then we went over to Giant, and we did do the Rockstar Energy Drink deal. Uh, Rockstar. I've never, I haven't drank these in like forever in a day. It's probably like 10 years since I've had a Rockstar. But back in my wild, rebellious late teen, early 20s, Rockstar staying up all night. Yeah, online gaming. Uh, I was, and you'd be in chat rooms. And we, we, you, me and my buddy, we used to like make up these like fake profiles. I mean, this is not to do, but yeah, we used to, um, we used to be an Amish man in a barn. And um, we were trying to hide it from the wife. We were connecting from the phone line in the in the barn, and yeah, I had an interesting. That was all that we had. So much fun, but those days are now gone, and you never you can't do that anymore online. But anyway, where am I going with it? Um, giant. I did buy six rock stars because when you buy six of these bad boys, you are going to get 400 gas points, which is good for 40 cents off a gallon. And I needed, I was going to Giant anyway, and I already had the Giant gas station, and I already had um, gas points, so I'm like, and I needed gas, so the deal is, is if you would get 25 gallons, that's obviously $10 off, and the Rockstars only cost you $9, because they're $1.50 a piece, so it's a moneymaker, but you have to get 25 gallons of gas to make it a moneymaker, but... I just enjoyed the discount, figured I'd get some rock stars, haven't had them in a while, and i get some more off my gas. So then I did go and get gas. I only needed 7.4 gallons, but I had 20 cents already plus another 40 cents. So I took 60 cents off, so I only paid $1.69 a gallon. When have we done that in a long time, at least in this part of the country? So I did buy twelve dollars and fifty cents of gas, but hey, so that was kind of one of those deals. If you need to get gas, take some rock stars. It's a fair trade, if you ask me. Plus, I think there's some water deals. There's a couple other deals that are included in there, but you can use coupons. And I did find a matchup site. It's not one that I've seen before, but they did have some matchups. Not a ton, but they did have some giant matchups. So, um. 
So if I'm gonna get a turkey, points expire. I need to get a turkey. So I can earn points till November 12th to get my turkey, or I'm just gonna spend it on gas. But I do my regular shopping there every week, so I'll probably get enough for a turkey if I so please to have a turkey. Yep, though that's what we bought. Um, that was cool. I only spent um, so I did spend close to 20 bucks already. But and CVS, if you were watching my coupon talk last night. I went to CVS and then I looked. I can't do early activation on the scope because there is a deal this week that goes with the Oral B and the Crest. The scope is included, so that extra buck deal would not trigger. As far as I know, I'm still going to get last this week's extra bucks, so I can't do that. They have lots of um, Febreze, so they have like 25 cans. So if that lady goes in there tonight and goes crazy, well then, woe with me. Um, and the userin deal, there is some userin in there. They had a decent stock, but I'm not worried about her because I don't think there's any good value userin coupons out, which there's, those don't come out till tomorrow. So I will be the first thing. So I will be able to get in there and get my userin cheap. Um, hope, assuming I get the coupons. But in the, the scope, they only had like four bottles. So I took two of them and hid them behind the Listerine. Have you ever done that? Gone to the store and hidden the products till they go on sale? Yeah, I did that. I posted this on my Facebook page. I did that. So I hid it behind the Listerine. So hopefully, if there aren't any stalkers in there and moving things around, they'll still be there. So I have to go out and about later, so I may have to pop back in and see. And if not, I may have to move them. Um, <laughs> I should take my user in and put them in there, too. I could ask the guy working there. He's nice, and sometimes he'll let me actually. He's the, uh, he'll let me get my basket, and he'll put it behind the counter so it's there when I come in on Sunday. But... You know, I don't like to take advantage of that situation. What fun is that? It's kind of like the challenge to see if you're actually going to have the stock. I know. We live in a very exciting life here in the coupon world. All right, enough talking. I will see you later for a Saturday afternoon chat and tomorrow for CVS Pharmacy. Thanks for watching. All righty. Bye-bye.